Okay, so first of all, I just wanted to apologize for kind of being MIA for about a week. It's been about a week or so since I've put out a video. The last video was my A5100 review, and well, right after that, I sold the camera and I sold my kit lens, and I bought a Sony A6500, which I'm now shooting on. But for a while, a little over a week, or actually, you know, the time that you guys haven't seen me, the only lens that I had was a 50 millimeter lens, which would be zoomed in like onto my eyes. So I, I couldn't vlog and I got really busy. I'm now a full-time videographer, but now I just got this lens. This lens is called a 16 millimeter 1.4 Sigma. Freaking amazing lens. This thing is beautiful to look into. So now I can vlog with you guys again. I'm back. I'm not going anywhere. I've gotten really busy lately. I've done like a lot of videography work in the past week, but I'm, I'm still here and I'm still gonna vlog with you guys. I just I just wanted to just wanted to say that it feels good to say that I'm staying what I wanted to do is take you through a couple of days as me Jordan the fitness cinematographer the fitness videographer I'm going right now to get a bang at the gas station the Exxon right outside why, why can't why you why you drive like that? this Exxon right here right outside of our neighborhood it has two dollar bangs they're two doll hairs there's nowhere oh there's a parking space right there I'm heading to the gym to Shelby to shoot the owner of the gym, Becca, she's a power lifter. I'm gonna shoot a little cinematic edit for her and then, then I'll get some workout footage for you guys. All right, guys, so I just got done at the gym, shot Becca, then I shot my workout. Now I'm actually going to head home and go ahead and start editing. Going to charge up all of my batteries, and then I will probably see you guys tomorrow. As far as I know right now, I'm shooting in Charlotte. The deal, guys. I was going to show you guys an edit. I was going to do an edit of me doing an edit of me working, but I introduced a lot of new things to my computer. I introduced 120 frames per second slow-mo with 4K as well 
with a lot of new special effects and basically my MacBook Pro just itself and died and it's, it's just now starting to recover. I almost lost the edit that I've been working on for eight hours, Rebecca. A lot of friends of mine spent a lot of money and got a really expensive camera, like an A7 III or like a big Canon camera. And like, they got like a $3,000 camera. This camera right here was a little over $1,000. This lens was a little over $500, which still expensive, but it's not as crazy. And the reason for that is I want to have money to spend to upgrade my computer gear and lighting and stuff because I know that just by upgrading to 4K and 120 frames per second slow-mo that it's going to beat the shit out of my MacBook Pro here. And um, I want to be able to afford to build my whole setup, not just have an expensive camera body. Edit is done. I'm now I'm heading to Charlotte to shoot with Josh. Going to get some gas. Going to drive Going to drive the Cobra today. I haven't driven the Cobra all week, but uh, let's see how this shoot with Josh turns out. <laughs> One of the things that I've been doing a lot lately with my workout cinematography, workout videography, whatever you want to call it, is tracking shots. And basically what a tracking shot is, is I will track their movement. So the camera will move with their body as they're performing whatever exercise that they're performing. So basically what I'm saying is I'll catch on to their movement and then I'll follow it and I'll do the whole thing in 120 frames per second and then I'll slow it down. It looks really cool. So we got a sick edit. Just got off the phone with a friend of mine who is a photographer mainly and does a little bit of videography as well. So now I'm gonna head home and yeah, I mean nothing special about this vlog. I just kind of wanted to show you what my life is like right now. I haven't been making as many videos because I've been busy, but I wanted to show you guys what I've been busy with. I've been shooting a lot of stuff lately and I'm, I'm still a fitness coach. So I'm pretty busy all of the time. <laughs> Right, right back at you, bike rider guy. have a car that you like what I always say is park beside other cars that like seem like they care about their cars and like you should be good so here's the deal this is the mic that I was using yesterday it's called the I don't even know what it's called model mic 10 or 108A stereo. I, I don't even know what it is. Anyways, it's old, but it's just, it was a mic to use. And so I was using it, but this piece right here, I don't even see this, this piece right here was like coming untouched and it was just like wiggling all the time and it was getting on my nerves. And so, you know, I got the idea to super glue it together. Actually, Gorilla Glue it. I went out and bought some Gorilla Glue last night. And what I accidentally did was Gorilla Glued this spinny thing, which, you know, needs to be able to spin up. Basically, this is useless now because I broke it. It was already broken, but I broke it worse. Now I gotta drive like 30, 40 miles to get a new mic. Really, 
really torn between the video might go and the video might grow. One thing you have to deal with basically all the time if you are a YouTube vlogger or just a video creator is going through mics like left and right. So I think I've basically decided on the video micro and <laughs> not really for the reason that I thought. It's, it's because I want this, this tripod, because the Joby on my camera is like old and it's falling apart. Alright, so this has absolutely nothing to do with the video so I apologize if by me talking about something that has absolutely nothing to do with the video that you're super offended and triggered. But I just met like a young girl and her dad pretty much talked them into buying the first camera so I'm really happy I, I, like this girl's probably gonna start a vlogging channel hopefully she does that'd be awesome if you're someone that normally goes in like Best Buy Walmart wherever you go and you just like don't talk to anybody like talk to people alright guys so I got the new mic on even got a new tripod look at this little jubby tripod look at this look at this little guy can you see it can you okay can, can you see it no yep yep alright let me let me just let's look at my mirror here Check this guy out. Oh my god, is that sexy or what? Uh, you guys can hear me. You're probably like, oh my god, I can hear you so intimately, Jordan. Why you do this to me? Why you do this to me?